Welcome to this week's episode of Granger Defined. Today we're taking a look at the Granger All Achieve program known commonly to students and faculty here as GAP. GAP was designed to help students who are struggling in their classes. But to explain in greater detail why Granger put into effect this program, we caught up with Mr. Haslam, who created GAP in order to help students get caught up to speed and where they should be with their education. Failure is not an option. We, we looked at, uh, when I was at my previous school, we looked at the data coming in, what could we do to uh, help students, and it, what it boiled down to is if students chose uh, during, this, during the quarter to drop below uh, into an F range, then we required them to, to come to extra learning time. And during that extra learning time, it was up to each teacher to define what that meant and how, the, how a student could get extra learning time in order to raise their grade, academic grade, to passing. Uh, but remember, F is probably the most significant grade in our grading system because F means nothing. I spent nine weeks of my time in a class, and if I receive an F, that meant nothing. I have to start all over again. I have to do the whole thing over again. And I, I, I just want to, we, we try to impress upon our students and our teachers do whatever you can to get a passing grade because a passing grade continues to move your learning on and moves you on to ultimately to graduation. I would say we, we, uh, we have after school tutoring, we have Monday morning tutoring going on. I would just check your students grades on gradebook. If they are failing, there is help on Monday mornings and after school each day in each curricular area. We try to set it up so that math, is on, uh, math after school is on one day, English after school is on another weekday, and sciences, biology and physical science, is on another day. So a student doesn't have to pick or choose. We, we align them on separate days. And, and most other curriculums, uh, social studies, uh, the arts, physical education, what have you, they are usually on Monday mornings. And if you want to call the school and check of, of when is English gap, we'd be more than happy to, uh, to, to get that uh, out to the parents. So now that we understand the purposes of gap, we wanted to give you an opportunity to see how teachers utilize this program in the classroom. We caught up with Mr. Okison, a math teacher here at Granger High School, who explains to us how he uses it to affect students' education. For a student, gap is an opportunity to, to meet one-on-one -on -one or one-on-five with a teacher and not be threatened in any way by 40 other students and to feel embarrassed that I can't do this type of math. They're able to come in and just work specifically with their teacher in a smaller setting so that they can get the personal help that they need. For parents, this is free tutoring. It's an opportunity for their child to come in and get an hour, hour and a half worth of help from specifically their teacher knowing exactly what's going to be on the test, what the assignment looks like. So it's an opportunity for their student to get extra help that the parent might not be able to afford or time-wise can't offer to their child. It's an opportunity for students to come in and, and get that extra help that, that I might have missed as a teacher. I teach 40 students and I try to make sure they all understand it, but I might miss one or two. This is a chance for them to come in and let me know, I'm not getting this concept, will you please help me? So now that we've explained GAP in greater detail, we would just like to give one final message, especially to parents that are watching. Parents, if you have students who are struggling, please have them attend GAP. It's an opportunity for your students to work individually with teachers and receive help in their education. So that's it for this week's episode. We'd just like to encourage you all to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.